Imam Shaltabi, he was blind and he, he composed the poems, more than a thousand lines, which discusses the different ways to read the Quran, the Usul and the Furush. Can you imagine? That's our Ummah. That's what our blind people did. In his poem, he says, Wa'alam anna habla Allahi fina kitabuhu fajahid bihi hibla al-ida mutahabbila. Ya Allah. He said, you have to know that the rope of God amongst us is the Quran. It's called Hablullah because the Habl is something that you grab onto in a time of need to reach a goal, to accomplish something. And for us, the Prophet said that the Quran, Hablullahi Mamdudu min as is is the rope of God extending from the heavens that we are responsible for holding up. This is a good hadith. I say that because sometimes I find people like, oh, Quran is hard or, you know, I struggle with it. But nobody struggles with Netflix. Nobody struggles to watch The Office. You know what I'm saying? Nobody struggles to play the new PS5. Why is it that shaitan and our nafs make us feel like the Quran is something we can't handle? But the sheikh, he says, وَجَاهِدْ bihi." So make jihad with it. I Meaning you got to make jihad against yourself to have a relationship with it. That's why Ibn Qayyim said about Wajahid bihi jihadan kabira, Wajahidun bihi jihadan kabira, that jahid bil Quran in the form is muta'ala. You know what I mean? Mushtaraka. That there's going to be some opposition. That the book won't come easy to you. But I can say this start to give at least five minutes a day for the Quran, get back with me. After one month, you can tell me how you feel after that. And you tell me about the unlimited doors that Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala will open for you when you have a relationship with His book, with His words. There's no better way to get close to Allah except with His words. When someone came to say, Uthman ibn Affan radiallahu anhu and said, how do I get close to Allah? He said, I know a no easier way than with his words. So make a little effort, man. Struggle a little. Push ourselves a little. And see where the Quran takes it.